Hi, and welcome to InjuryGuru.com. I'm Carla Schimmelfinnig, Registered Physical Therapist. And this truly is the last video in the knee exercise program number one. This is uh, video number eight called Prone Hangs. Uh, now, I had told you uh, in the last video that um, if you are lacking um, some extension, so if you just can't straighten that painful knee out all the way, or as much as your good knee, uh, then I want you to include this stretch in your exercise program. And just include this uh, stretch as long as you uh, are not able to straighten that knee all the way. Once that knee straightens all the way, you can stop this uh, stretch or exercise altogether. Uh, Mason is going to show you this stretch. Uh, just a couple things I want to tell you about this. Um, I use this often. A lot of us therapists use this exercise um, when someone is lacking knee extension or they just can't straighten that knee out all the way. Uh, it works really well. I can tell you though when you first start this I only want you to do it for a few minutes uh, at a time because it can be uh, quite uncomfortable. Uh, but the more you do it, um, I want you to add a little bit more time to it, the more you do it as long as it's becoming more tolerable and it's a little more comfortable. Uh, so for this stretch you can do this anywhere up to 10 minutes um, if needed and uh, a lot of times five six minutes is all that's needed but you may need to do this um, two or three times throughout the day at this point uh, just to get that uh, knee straightening out all the way and remember as soon as that knee is straightened all the way then you can forget about this stretch and just keep up with all the exercises so let me uh, have you Mason show you this exercise or stretch called the prone hang the prone hang exercise is exactly what this looks like. Um, you're going to lay on your stomach like Mason is. You can do this laying on your bed or on the floor. The, your bed is the best bet because you can let your leg hang off of the bed. Now, for most of you, because you have a decrease in that knee extension or you're not able to straighten the knee out all the way, your leg may be stuck up like this, all right, versus what normal is. If Mason just lets his leg relax, that's, that's pretty normal. But like I said, for most of you, your leg may be stuck up here, maybe even stuck up here. Um, so what you're going to do then, um, again, I, if you do this laying on your bed, you're going to lay toward the edge of the bed so that your um, knee and the rest of your leg is hanging off of the bed. I want you to put a rolled up towel, like you can see here, I, I just rolled up a hand towel, and put that right up um, under the thigh, so right up above his knee but under your thigh. And um, if you do this on the floor, same thing. You gotta have that towel there. Especially if you do it on the floor, you, you have to have your, that towel there so it raises the leg up a little bit so that gravity can then work on pushing that lower leg down. All right, so um, as, well, as therapists, we use this exercise a lot. We have our patients go home and do this exercise um, quite often because it just works really well. All you're doing is just letting gravity weigh that leg, weight that leg down and just pull it down. When you do this, you're going to feel quite a bit of stretch um, and, and discomfort in the back of that thigh and knee. Um, I want you, when you first start this, I want you just to do it for a few minutes. And um, that's because it's going, for, for a lot of you, it's going to be a pretty intense stretch. Um, do that for a few minutes, just get up and go about your business. Um, each day though, Every, every couple days, if you can tolerate staying in that position a little longer, then I want you to increase your time. And I want you to increase it up to 8 to 10 minutes until that knee is straight. Once this knee is straight, you can forget about this one and just keep on with all the exercises in this program. Uh, so that is it for the prone hang, which is just laying on your stomach. And on that bed, make sure you have a towel up under that thigh. And you're just letting gravity take a hold of that leg and get you a good stretch behind that knee. Make sure it's tolerable. I don't want to increase any of that knee pain that you've been having. Uh, for this one, sorry, I forgot to tell you how many times a day. I want you to do this um, two to three times a day if you can get it in. If not, at least once a day and throw in a second time during the day if you can.